Hey everybody, Aaron here. Welcome back to my anime review. Today we look at episode 15 of Fox Beer and Matchmaker. Okay, so, first and foremost, Toho, damn, twice getting stabbed in the stomach by someone's hand. Mainly in this case, you know, once because he wanted uh, Coco to use his power, and another time because Coco decided to use him as a kind of means of getting to the old man. And, you know, when he escaped at one point. Oh, you, you get stabbed a lot in the stomach, man. You okay? That, that must be painful. That, like, legit must be painful. Um, but what's very interesting, though, is we're seeing some cool things already. We're seeing Toho's relationship with Coco kind of advance into the fact that he already has feelings for her. That's clear as day from him, like, basically, you know, once he did survive the first, I want to say, uh, uh, almost near-death experience, he's right away saying, oh, yeah, he's, she thinks she's, he, he thinks she's beautiful, which she's said before, but... You know, he's already trying to brag to this one girl who's a, apparently a leech yokai, which she's very cute when she's not a leech. When she's a leech, it's she's kind of terrifying. But, you know, he's bragging like, oh, yeah, you know, I, I, he, she really likes me this way and she thinks I'm powerful, etc. She thinks your power is powerful, yeah, but that doesn't mean per se you. Now, at least not yet. I mean, it, it's interesting, but, you know, it looks like already we're starting to advance towards them being on a kind of mission or adventure together, most likely. And I'm already looking forward to seeing that, our, I mean, from at least episode 15, I can already kind of tell that even though this is, Crunchyroll is doing this very odd thing, and that's why it's hard for me to explain to people who are maybe new to Fox, Mac, Fox Beer Matchmaker, which I do apologize if that seemed, that like a little bit right there seemed a little awkward for me too. Um, it's doing something very odd, which is that we're not really at a season two per se, but the same token, apparently the original Chinese adaptation, or Chinese version of Fox Beer Matchmaker was actually at at season two with this part so what they did was Crunchyroll is they made it all you know the Japanese version is all one episode so season two is a continuation obviously as I learned from like I think two episodes ago but it's a little weird because I say that and you can already tell though where the animation budget is going in terms of like how much better you know episode 15 and 14 looked in comparison to episode 13 from the the first part you know, it, it just is night and day. And we're also seeing a lot more action and also visceral content, which we didn't see very much of in the first season. We saw it, don't get me wrong, but it wasn't at the same level. I mean, you know, it, it's probably a little bit, I want to say, muted from obviously the Chinese version, which I'm going to do some research about that. But it, it is really cool to see this, and I'm, I'm really enjoying it so far. I think that, you know, these last two episodes have been way better than Fox Beer Matchmaker's first couple episodes alone. Uh, I want to see where Toho and Coco now go and continue their journey. You know, I do wonder how long this arc is going to last, and I'm presuming maybe for the whole, you know, quote-unquote season. But, you know, I, if you guys know in the comments below, because I, I do rely on my Chinese audience with this, you know, let me know, please, if you don't mind, uh, how many episodes we're going to have of this kind of flashback uh, story. Is it going to be the remainder of the season, or is it going to be just several more episodes, and then we go back to Haku and, you know, the current people like uh, Susu and all that, etc. Anyways, guys and girls, I will talk to you later. I hope you enjoyed this review. You know, I'm telling you, I'm very surprised about this season. It's, or excuse me, well, this continuation. You know, it's doing wonders, and I'm really enjoying it so far. And I can see why people have told me countless times over and over again to keep up with the show, don't give up on it. And I'm happy I'm not giving up on it. I'm going to keep going. Uh, I don't know if I'm the only person reviewing this on YouTube. I think I'm one of the few, maybe, that's doing it. But I really appreciate uh, the constant support that you guys are giving me. Even when I upload these things a little late, you guys are still doing, you know, wonders in terms of sharing the video around so continue doing that please you know like the video share the video around etc i will talk to you guys later god bless you all i have one other review today which is welcome to the ballroom so if you want to see that it'll be out probably within an hour um you know i'm just giving you guys a little break from me constantly uploading at least trying to i'll talk to you guys later god bless you all Bye bye